Hi guys, welcome back to Algo Test. In this video, we're going to be continuing on our series of taking stocks, trading them intraday with signals and indicators. In this video, we're going to be taking the HDFC bank stock and we're going to be putting the EMA indicators on it and trade a strategy known as the EMA crossover. I reiterate, it's only a demonstration of the feature. We neither recommend buying any stock nor do we recommend using any specific technical indicator. The choice is yours. We're just trying to demonstrate how you can do so and automate your trading if you so wish. All right, let's get straight into the video. So I'm on the Algodest landing page and I'm going to click on go to dashboard. Where it says signals, I'm going to hover over there and click on signals dashboard. Now I'm going to click on a new signal over here, trading view indicators, forward test. All right, let's first head to trading view and we've selected the HDFC bank chart over here. What we're going to do is we're going to click on indicators select EMA all right and there it is moving average exponential click on it twice and let's make one EMA have a length of let's say 100 and the other EMA can have a length of let's say 20 and change this color to let's say green a little thicker and let's change the blue one blue is fine just make it a little thicker all right Okay, so now what we have here is we have two different lines, two different exponential moving average lines. One is a higher time frame. So essentially one has a hundred period EMA and the other is, which is a slow moving EMA, the hundred period EMA. And then you have the 20 period EMA, which takes the last 20 candles into account. And this is the green one, right? The blue one is the slower one, the, the hundred EMA and the green one is the fast one. So the idea is the blue one will show you or the 100 EMA one will show you whether the trend is generally up or generally down and the fast moving EMA which is the 20 EMA will show you whether the trend at this moment in time on a shorter time frame is it moving up or down right so as you can see over here this blue line indicates that there's a general uptrend in HDFC bank and this green line is showing you that it's you know quite a fast moving uptrend right and similarly you can see the blue line over here is you know starting to slow down and the green line crosses below and that happens and after that happens you can see that the stock begins to trend downwards right so simple rule is if the green line is above the blue line it's in the uptrend if the blue line is above the green line it's in a downtrend and that's what we're going to take as the basis for our trading strategy today so i'm going to head back to algo test and i'm going to click on create strategy select stocks over here and select the underlying as HDFC bank and change the exit time to say 325 entry time to 920 whatever you want click on cash over here in the leg builder quantity you can change it to whatever you want I'm just gonna take 10 click on buy and add leg right now let's add a quick stop loss to this of let's say 20% and a target profit of let's say 30% all right now let's click on save and continue name this as hdfc by ema done okay let's leave the alert signal hdfc entry okay click on save now i'm going to copy this json block just click copy head to trading view and now let's set up the conditions to automate this so we're going to click on add alert over here symbol is hdfc bank in the condition, we're going to select EMA 20 first, right? Crossing up and crossing up of what? Crossing up of the 100 EMA close, right? So basically what we're saying is once this green line, which is the 20 EMA moves above the blue line, which is the 100 EMA, we want to buy the stock. So select once per bar and paste the JSON block here. Now back to algo test, click on I have pasted, copy the webhook URL, head back to trading view where it has the webhook URL section in the notifications tab, get rid of this, paste the webhook URL, click on create and that's the entry signal or the buy signal done. Now what we also want to do is we want to have an exit signal, right? So let's say if in, for example, here, um, the market went up so the green line went above the blue line and we bought it but we also want to exit on the basis of two things either our stop loss 
or when once the green line crosses below the blue line right so in this case what we're going to do is click on add exit alert name it as hdfc exit save copy the json block back to trading view once again we're going to click on add alert now we're going to select uh, ema 20 once again and crossing down of the ema 100 right paste the json block over here where it says message back to algo test click on i have pasted copy the webhook url head back to trading view under the notifications tab where it says webhook url erase this paste this click on create and now you're done now it's listening for the signals once the signal entry criteria occurs the trade will be taken and the exit entry conditions will be all as per we just defined it so once again guys this was just a quick demonstration of how you can use the EMA crossover type of strategy on any kind of stock that you want to trade. You can automate all of this on AlgoTest without having to write any code at all. All right, guys, thanks for watching this quick video. We hope you enjoyed it and we hope you find this feature really useful. Please like the video, share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.